There was a discussion or an option that ultimately the assets of 1MDB uh, will become standalone companies, right? So TRX will become a standalone company, Banda Malaysia will become a standalone company, uh, Edra will become a standalone company, uh, etc. That was what we had envisaged as part of the rationalization plan. So we then uh, looked at the bids that we received for Edra. Uh, and it made sense when we looked at the valuation as a whole uh, for us to dispose 100%. But if you remember earlier in the rationalization plan, we thought we might retain 30%, right? So in the case of Bandar Malaysia and TRX, when the rationalization plan was announced, uh, we stated that we would like to own 40% uh, of each company. Uh, at this stage, with the success of EDRA, the sale of EDRA, uh, we have decided to hold 40% of Banda Malaysia, and at the moment we are still owning 100% of TRX. So from the time the rationalization plan was announced till today, given the success and the valuations that we've achieved, given uh, the impact on our cash flows and our debt repayment, we have managed to um, reorganize how or what we sell and how much we sell. So I think that's conceptually uh, an important point. So in relation to the 40% stake in Banda Malaysia, at this stage, it's owned by 1MDB, but the option always remains if it becomes a standalone company uh, for that stake uh, to be owned by the MOF. How that stake gets transferred, what gets paid, etc., has not even been considered yet because at this stage, it's still owned by 1MDB.